It's really important. Um, and the yeah there there is the the movement to um, to the urban areas and so you have to look at why is that happening and if you're able to address that why to understand the why and to address it so that your nation in your own homelands can benefit from the knowledge and the the energy and and you know all the the enthusiasm that we have in our younger generation and um, not have them move into and, and bring their energy into the urban areas, bring their energy out to, to you know, the word. It's not so much bring their energy out. It's taking the energy out of their nation and bringing it and, and um, having it, using it somewhere else. That's, I think, is, is um, what we have to be really concerned about and be able to offer the... The, um, the same life expectations that they could have by moving into the urban area. It's going to be very, very difficult because some of our, our homelands are, you know, really isolated. And, yeah, they, the pull to go to the cities is very much there. But I think that they're also, once you understand and when, once you get a real um, full appreciation of who you are as an individual, your nation, you know, where your nation is, where, where you come from, that... You can be in the city, but still have a direct connection to your own homeland. And I speak of my own, my daughter and, and her family, my grandchildren. You know, they grew up in the city, but they still know their Kdunecha. They have the pull back to where our homeland is, although they live out on the West Coast.